Welcome back to my channel. Today we're starting our day really early. It's um, 7 a.m. our time and I'm lighting my diffuser with eucalyptus oil just to start my day and get ready for a real life cleaning. Today we have a real life uh, complete kitchen disaster. Oh my god. And yeah, this is how it looked. Um, because I didn't do anything last night. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and unload the dishwasher and reload the dishwasher and so forth and get this day started. This is simply what happens when you're just too beat the night before to do anything but we're gonna get it under control and we're gonna get it nice and clean stay tuned and hang in there with me and guys please subscribe and leave a comment below thank you Just a FYI, but I always have a garbage bowl on the side of me with bags inside of it to scrape um, any dishes or any food that's left behind so I don't have to run back and forth to the trash. And then after I'm done with all the crumbs and all the leftover food, I go ahead and toss it in the trash then. But yeah, it's really handy to have uh, a plastic bag to clean out the sink, you know, scrape off dishes, so forth. It makes it really easy so have a bag close by while you're cleaning it And um, for the the pizza pan and the um, the cookie sheets, I usually um, I usually dry those off. But I also, after I've dried them off, I also put a, a thin layer of coconut oil on the pans so that um, they don't rust. Because I don't know about you, but I'm pretty bad at you know keeping things dry or letting them air dry so I found that the cookie sheets you let them air dry they do rust from time to time and I hate that so coconut oil is the the thing that helps the most and here I'm noticing that I had a really um, slow drain so I just put some baking soda in the drain and then rinsed it down with some um, distilled vinegar and then afterwards I just ran um, hot water as hot as the faucet would make it that way it would clear the drain a little bit more it's really helpful if you have a slow drain And now I'm just using my handy Citrus Shine um, stainless steel cleaner to uh, clean and shine um, my stainless steel dishwasher and so forth. And you can actually find this at Amazon or um, I, I normally get mine from Sears because we have a Sears locally. So yeah, the Citrus Shine, I actually recommend it very, very much.
And if you've made it this far through the video, if you would please put a panda emoji in the comment section. I appreciate you so much and thank you and keep watching.
I don't know if you can see that, but my floors had so many crumbs and just dirt and just food. It was just so nasty. Oh my god. I, it's embarrassing. I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, I'm getting it up. But yeah, my floor really needed an extremely good cleaning. Now after I get all this dirt up, what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, get my spray bottle. I have already have it pre-filled with some Pledge Multi-Surface Floor Cleaner. And that's what I like to use because it's a concentrate. So I can just put it in my spray bottle, um, add water, and it's good to go. And I just spray and go, spray and go. And it just makes it so much easier to get up all the dirt and grime and you know sometimes you have stuck on food and so forth so spray those areas and let it soak for a minute and scrub 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 I just want to say I am so grateful and thankful um, if you have made it this far into the video and uh, thank you so much for my loyal subscribers I, I love y'all so much and if you have made it to this uh, part of the video if you would just put a cat emoji in the comment section so that I know that you've made it this far thank you so much I hope this gives you great motivation to get your kitchen clean. This is a real life clean and you know life happens. But you know it's a daily chore that we have to tackle so make it pleasant and enjoy your day. I love you guys.
thank you for watching and please like comment and subscribe have a good day